So, Dr. Mayhem says, unfortunately, I don't have any interesting war stories involving combat. For oh, some thanks. odd reason, any thanks combat that happened was five minutes after I left. Oh. However, I do have an insight into Iraqi culture and why we should oven them, even if <laughs> they were Nazi sympathizers back in the day and have a raging murder boner for Jews. <laughs> Everyone knows how in black culture they have that policy of keeping on the down low in regards to f it was usually some case of Jamal and Tyrone getting out of prison and not quite adjusting to life on the outside and getting caught after they got high and fooled around. In Muslim culture, homosexuality is supposedly punishable by death, but it still remains fairly rampant. I think it has more to do with not wanting men to act like effeminate puftas and not so much as men who f*** out on Men Love Thursday and keep it secret. Raping little boys is also considered normal. So uh. here's the story. I was sitting in a tower guard duty and had to observe a small camp of Iraqis in the distance. The radio conversation went as follows. Uh, hey guys, got something to report. Well, this is weird, but you know that Iraqi camp you want me to keep tabs on? <laughs> There's three naked guys standing outside jacking each other off, and they're all <laughs> pointing at me. Should I... Should I shoot them? Command. Yes. Why in the fuck did you think that was worth reporting me? Well, you did say to report anything unusual. <laughs> That's not usual. It's the definition of unusual. That is unusual. Yeah. Man Love Thursday really is a real thing in the Middle East. 